Struggling with laggy, blurry, or choppy OBS recordings? Don't worry, you don't need a powerful PC to fix it. In this video, I'll show you the best OBS settings for 2025, whether you're on a low, mid, or high-end setup, so you can finally record and stream smoothly. First, open OBS and head over to Settings. Now, go to the Video tab. In the Base Resolution, make sure it matches your monitor's native resolution. If you're on a low-end PC, set it to 1280 by 720. Finally, set the FPS, go with 60 FPS if your system can handle it, or 30 FPS if you're on a low-end setup. Next, go to the Output tab and switch the Output mode to Advanced. Let's start with the streaming settings, since many of you might want to stream on YouTube. For the encoder, if you're on a low-end PC, select X264, or if you have a good GPU, choose NVIDIA HEVC. And if you've got both a powerful GPU and CPU, go with NVIDIA H264 for the best balance. In rate control, select constant bitrate. On a low-end PC, set it between 2,500 to 4,500 kilobits per second. For a mid- or high-end PC, you can safely increase it for better quality. Use higher values depending on your internet speed and system power. For the preset, start with medium if you're on a low-end PC. If your system can handle more, you can go with slow for higher quality, and even slower if you want the best quality. But remember, the slower the preset, the more power it needs from your PC. Now, let's move on to the recording settings. For the recording format, on a low-end PC, choose MP4. For mid- and high-end PCs, go with MKV since it's safer and more reliable. For the video encoder, use the same logic as in streaming settings. If low-end PC, select X264. Good GPU. Choose NVIDIA HEVC, powerful GPU plus CPU. Go with NVIDIA H264 for the best results. In rate control, select constant bitrate. For the recording bitrate, on a low-end PC, start with 2,500 to 3,500 kilobits per second. If the video looks blurry, gradually increase it up to 5,000, 7,000. On a mid-range PC, set it between 10,000, 12,000. On a high-end PC, you can push it to 20,000 to 30,000 kilobits per second for top quality recordings. For the preset, go with medium if you're on a low-end system. If your PC can handle it, try slow for better quality, or even slower for the best quality. But keep in mind that it demands more processing power. We're done with the settings part. Don't forget to hit apply to save everything. Here is the bonus tip. If you're recording games, always use game capture instead of display capture. It runs much smoother and gives better performance. And also, head back into settings, advanced and under process priority. Set it to above normal. This gives OBS more priority on your system, helping reduce lag and stutters. And that's it guys. You're now ready to record and stream with the best OBS settings for 2025. If this video helped you, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe for more creator tips. Drop a comment below and let me know what kind of PC you're using. Low end, mid range, or high end. I'd love to hear from you. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Happy streaming!